What's up? In this video, I'm going to show you how you can lock and hide apps completely on your Samsung Galaxy S25 series. Let's go. Welcome back to the video. My name is Sergio and in this channel I make life-saving tech videos. So if you're new here, feel free to subscribe and hit the bell while you're down there. All right, let's get right to it. Uh, so first I'm going to show you how to lock apps. So you have to, so that anyone that's using, that's on your phone can't just open up an app. Um, you can lock certain apps to prompt for a passcode when uh, trying to open, or you can also hide the app altogether. So it won't show up anywhere on your phone, but it will, it will stay on your phone. Um, so let's get right into it. So first, in order to lock and hide apps, you're going to need to set up your secure folder. And we do this by going to settings here in settings. We're going to scroll down to security and privacy. Okay. Here in security and privacy, we're going to scroll down to more security settings. And here in more security settings, we're going to see the option here, secure folder. So we're going to go ahead and select it and we're going to have to set up the secure folder. So let's go ahead and do that now. So just go through all the settings here to get your uh, secure folder set up. You are going to have to log into your Samsung account. Okay. So you're going to have to set up a lock type for your secure folder. So you can do fingerprints, pattern, password. I'm just going to do pin for the purpose of this video. Okay. So after you go through all the steps, it's going to create your secure folder. All right. So now that you have the secure folder installed, let's go ahead and show you how to lock the apps. Okay, so how we hide apps is you have to log, you have to go into your secure folder. Here in secure folder, select the plus sign. And here it's going to allow you to add apps to your secure folder. So let's say we want to add Facebook, YouTube, and TikTok. Okay, go ahead and select add. And as you can see, um, Facebook, TikTok, and YouTube are now in the secure folder. Okay, so now that we have the apps in the secure folder, Let's log in so we can check them out. Uh, you have to enter the pin to enter the secure folder. So as you can see, both apps are right here, TikTok and YouTube, but the apps will still be here in your home screen and in your apps. Okay. So uh, we are going to have to remove them from here. So how you do that is you're going to tap and hold on the app here in your home screen and select remove. Let's do the same thing for YouTube remove. Okay. Let's scroll up to all of the apps and find them as well. So here, uh, I think YouTube is in the Google folder. So we're going to press and hold on YouTube and we're going to select disable. Okay. Disable. As you can see, YouTube is removed and let's find TikTok right over here. We're going to go ahead and tap and hold on it and select uninstall. Okay. It's going to uninstall TikTok. Yep. There we go. So now we don't have YouTube or TikTok anywhere on the phone. Okay. So they can't be accessed anywhere on the phone other than by logging back in to the secure folder. Okay, so if we log back into the secure folder, even though we deleted the apps from the home menu and apps menu, they will still be here in the secure folder and you can log into them and they will work fine. Okay, there will, the apps will still be fully functional. As you can see, TikTok is functioning as well. All right, and if you want to take it one step further, you can even go ahead and hide the secure folder. So you, the apps won't be anywhere on your phone and the secure folder is not going to appear anywhere as well. So you do that by going into settings. Once again, going to security and privacy. Okay. Once again, go to more security settings. And then here, once again, we're going to go into the secure folder. So type in your pin or password. And then what we're going to do here is we're going to disable add secure folder apps to screen. Okay. So it's going to ask you to confirm by selecting hide. All right. So now we're not even going to have the secure folder either in the apps here or in the home screen and the apps that we locked and hid won't be anywhere on the phone either. Okay. Um, so the only bad thing about this is that, you know, uh, you won't be able to reach the apps because they're going to be completely hidden. So once you're ready to log back into the apps, you'll have to go back to settings and go back into security and privacy, more security settings and secure folder, enter your password or pin. And then we'll have to just enable add secure folder to apps screen once again. And uh, your secure folder will be here once again so that you can log into it and use your hidden apps. All right, everyone, there you go. So that is how you lock and hide apps on your Samsung Galaxy S25 series. Go ahead and hit the like button if this video helped you. 
and comment down below and let me know. That's all for this video. Catch you in the next one. As always, peace.